Hello everyone and welcome to Scrap Mechanic with Mavki. Uh, this is a new game that um, launched recently. It's a, a pre-alpha. Well, no, it's not really a pre-alpha. It's a beta version, it says over here. Um, and uh, I already played it for about an hour or so, and it's really a lot of fun. Uh, you might also have already seen this game on Rongo's channel, as he did a Let's Try video. Um, this is not so much going to be a Let's Try, but just a... a a build video and uh, to have some fun. So um, let's just jump into a new world and let's call that Mavki. Uh, this doesn't generate uh, any type of specific world. The world is always the same, but let's make it private uh, and do whatever. Create. So uh, the point of this game is if it's completely new to you, um, just to build cool stuff, and uh, you've got engines, rotating stuff, and this is just telling you to uh, uh, go to one on your hotbar, and you get this book in your hands, and if you press that, you'll get uh, a manual that, that will uh, explain how to move around. Um, this is a tutorial on how to build your first car, and it exists of multiple pages. Um, this is how bearings work. So if you're completely new, this will tell you how everything works. And some parts even have videos on it. Um, now, now, I already did that, so uh, I'm not going to have to do that. But uh, yeah, I'm just going to build with you guys. Let's find a nice spot to, uh, to build in. Oh, this is nice and flat. Let's see if we can optimize some of the video settings. Uh, graphics. Hi, 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 hi. Oh, that didn't like me doing that. It didn't like me doing that. Um, let's see, all high. Yeah. Something change? No, not really. Well, anyway, how this works is you place a lift. This is our lift, and with up and down, you can move it up and down. Um, now the building on this is very intuitive. If we press I, we get our inventory. Um, there's all kinds of different blocks. These are building blocks. These are uh, uh, I-beams, uh, all, all kinds of stuff. Some fun th stuff as well, like toilet paper. Um, there's a foot mannequin or a mannequin boot, a rubber ducky, um, some, some nice signage. So um, oh, open planter. There's a, uh, well, you can just go nuts with this. Uh, this is your tool pack uh, that's standard on your hotbar. So this is the handbook that explains how everything works. This is a sledgehammer that will just let you hit stuff around. And this is the lift I just placed. And this is our connection tool that will make every mechanical thing work. Now, what I want to do in this video is try and see if we can build a jet airplane. Um, and the flying, well, this game is not a flight simulator. So... Don't expect this to go right right off the bat. Um, but the first thing we need to do is, if you um, hold a block, you can drag it in the direction the arrows is, are pointing in. Now, if I press Q, you can see the arrows switching directions. And um, yeah, the drag thingy will go in a different direction. Now, what I'm going to do is build a symmetrical base. And the reason why I'm doing it symmetrical is, um, like I said, it's not a, a flying simulator. So everything going straight up in the air needs to be exactly, um, whatchamacallit, um, even. Otherwise, you're going to have issues keeping it straight. Now, to keep it straight, we now have um, our cockpit. Fly in, so this is a driver's seat. We can get in there and nothing will work because we have nothing connected to it yet and it's still on the lift. Um, now, basic thing that we want to do is get up. So we are going to lift this up and go into our inventory and there is these thrusters, our jet engines. So let's get that on our hotbar and Make sure that we have proper lift to go up. Now, as I said, it is important that everything is balanced. And as you can see, my cockpit is one back further than it is to the front. So I'm going to get my cockpit back out. 
um, remove that one, do the lift a little bit to the lower, and try and get it centered. Well, apparently we can't get it centered, but that's close enough. We'll just plop another block on the front and hope for the best. So, well, we can just extend this out and make it centered. Uh, this one. Yay! So, next thing, this is to get us up. We need to get propulsion, uh, propulsion forward. So, I'm going to get my thrusters again and this will propel us forward now this will let's test it out just for fun um how this works is this is our driver's seat and we can connect that if i connect it to these thrusters uh all the way uh, straight away um as soon as i sit down in that chair the thrusters will uh, activate and they will stay on for uh, for as long as I sit in that chair and maybe even after that so I don't want that now the way we can get around that is going into our inventory and select a button now what this button does is as long as I press the button um, the thrusters will engage so I'm gonna connect my driver's seat to one of the buttons so this is now button number one, and I'll connect that to the thrusters underneath. Now, if I sit in my chair and I press my uh, number one, or my hotkey number one, um, those bottom ones will get a propulsion, a propulsion. And now this is number two. So if I press number two, we will go forward. Now let's try that out. And uh, like I said, it's not going to be sit stable. Um, let's get in here. This is us. Now you can see on my hotbar I've got two buttons. This is number one. And it's not even, as you can tell. Now, oh, wrong button. Reason why it's not even is because, let's place this back on the floor, is we did put thrusters on the f back, making it heavier on this side. So as, long, uh, as soon as I um, thrust upwards, the thing will tilt backwards. Now, if we want to compensate that, we can also put thrusters on the front, maybe even um, enabling us to, uh, let's get you out of there, enabling us to go backwards. So let's put a button right there, connect that up. Right, so button one is going up, button two is going forward, and button three will thrust us backwards. Now, let's get back in our chair. And now we should have a pretty stable one. Yep, we're pretty stable. Not really that stable altogether, but we're going straight up in the air. Now, this is going forward, and this is going backwards. Yep. Whee! So, that's just having fun. Now, that's, that's not really stable. Um, so, we're going to have to work with that. Let's place you on a spot where we can actually get somewhere. Um, now, what we can do to make it more stable is extend this out a bit. That's one, two, three, and four blocks out. So you need to come out four as well. One, two, Three, four, yep. So now we've got wings on it. Those wings will actually not do anything much, but what we could do now is put this up a bit, put some more thrust underneath it, uh, maybe like so. Is that in the middle? That is in the middle. And what we also could do is put this back down, even that out so we can get back down again. Now connect that up again. Oh, no, we need an extra button because we've got a new direction. Extra button right there. Now, you, number four, is for getting back to Earth again. Um, we've got more thrusters down there. That one. 
that is going to be on the same line as this one. This is connected to number one. So we are going to connect that number one as well and connect number one to that one as well. This is the bigger we go or the more we build, this is going to be one giant mess of wires going around or it's not really wires, but it's connections. So if you can't follow it up to here, it's not really a problem. As long as everything works, we still need to take that thing out from underneath it. Otherwise it won't fly get back in our seat and now we are going straight up yay now if we go up and press number four we should get down again that's good and let's try to get ourselves straight up again yep there we go so this is forward this is backwards um as you can see if i fly up i will eventually start to tilt a bit now if i tilt to that side i want to correct that um the way we're going to do that is get off of our chair and place one block. Can I jump? Yeah. Uh, do it like that. We are going to have to be able to um, bank a little. Ba oh, that's in the wrong spot. Bank left and bank right. So let's try that out. We now fly up and we start to, oh, I forgot one important thing and you guessed it. I forgot more connections. Yeah. So, um, put a connection there, connect the button to the chair and we want number five to bank that way. And we want another button to bank the other way and we're getting there so upwards now if I press 5 you can see we're banking a bit so this will actually get us yay we're flying Bank left. We I'm on top of the world. Do a flip? Can we do a flip? Oh, and we crash landed on the flip. Now that's all fun and games, but we're we're steering it by banking it, and we should also be able to turn it around. So let's get to a flat spot. I like the scenery in this game. So last connections we're going to do is we're going to put another thruster here and another thruster there and one next to that and one next to that. And we should, oh, it's too high up. Get down from, yeah, there you go. Extra buttons. Connect that button to that one, or this, the chair to that one. Now this number seven will control that front one. And let's see which one it is, that back one. And this number eight will connect to this front one and that back one so this is the mess we made with all the wires uh and it is a mess but now if we get that lift on the from underneath it and get in our chair we should by pressing number eight be able to switch or uh, turn uh, turn directions so now if we try fly up and level it off a bit we're flying we
Well, it's still a rough landing, but and we're on, on top. But the thing now is if we press, I think it's, well, that one works, but that one works as well. Yep. And try and get it straight. And we're straight. So we're on a piece of wood with uh, how many? Two, four, six, eight, twelve, and another four. Sixteen rockets. But it's getting us airborne. Whee! And the hardest part about this is not really building it, because as you saw, we, we could do that in 15 minutes. The hardest part is actually controlling it. Now, and, and the worst thing is, as you can see at the, the bottom of the screen, there's that hot bar with all the buttons. I have no clue which one, which button is what. So I just know one is up and two is to the front and three is backwards. Uh, five is banking that way. Yep. Six is banking it straight. Seven is turning. It's kind of like uh, flying a carpet. Whee! Let's see. Uh, that way. That way. Now, let's see if we can get this a little bit more stable. Uh, no guarantees here, guys, but what happens if we extend that out? Uh, yep. And keep in mind that we have to keep it consistent and um, symmetrical, otherwise we won't fly. Now, let's see to a bit more wingspan. How many is that? That's six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So these are um, extra. Uh, if I hold down right mouse button, I can either take one block out or drag it again and take everything out. Now, um, now it might be more stable to the sides, but I want to have it stable to the back as well. And no clue how far that extended. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh. Mouse did a funky thing. One, two, three. Yeah, from there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's try it again now. Let's see if it flies. Oh, well, it's going well so far. Let's bank and turn it a bit. I want it to turn the other way. That way. We're flying! We Now, lofty goal, let's try to land it on, let's say, this mountain spot over here.
Well, it's not really much of a landing, <laughs> but we're on the mountainside, at least close enough. So, yeah, uh, let's get my ladder, pick you up, or it's a lift. I'm stuck in my airplane. And... Come on. Come on. I'm stuck! Uh, I might have made a boo-boo, guys. <laughs> well, um, we crashed our airplane and we're stuck in it right now. So uh, that's a good, a good spot to call this episode. Um, if you liked it, leave a like. Tell me in the comments if you uh, think I should um, do some more of this game on YouTube. I am going to do a, a build competition sort of thingy with, with Rongo in which we're going to build a, a vehicle and then race it afterwards to, just, for, just for the hack of it. Um, now, can I get... I'm just going to get you off. Yeah. Uh... And I can't get it up on the... Well, I'm going to have to deconstruct this. Oh, no, I don't. There we are. So, uh, yeah, if you liked it, leave a like and uh, I'll see you uh, around. So, thanks for watching. Bye.